One of the most common things we get asked about on Chromebooks is how to copy and paste. And while the shortcuts to do that are pretty straightforward, and we'll, we'll talk about those in this video too, uh, Chromebooks actually now have a much better way to copy and paste. It's far more powerful than what you're kind of used to doing with, you know, just copying one thing and then pasting it and then moving on to the next thing. So we want to go through all the ways that you can really utilize copy and pasting on your Chromebook. Okay, so let's start with the most basic things. I'm gonna type some text in here, type some text. And then I'm gonna highlight that text. And if I want to copy it, uh, cut it or paste it, I can do those with the standard shortcuts. If you don't know those, you just hold Control X is cut, meaning it's gonna delete it off the page and then put it on your clipboard for pasting later. Uh, C is copy, I meaning it's gonna copy it, but it's not gonna take it off the page. And then V uh, is pasting, and that's obviously gonna put it into the place you wanna, you wanna put it. So if I hit Control X here, you see that it goes away. Control V puts it back. And then if I highlight all of it again, and we do Control C for copy, we don't really see anything happen. But if I go down to the next line and hit Control V for paste again, then you'll see it uh, paste it into place there. So that's the basic, you know, way to go about copy and pasting on this. That, that stuff works on Windows too, and substitute control for command, and those things all work on uh, Mac OS as well. Uh, those have been around for a long time, but what Chrome OS has added now, I'm gonna go down here just a little bit. If you use the search or everything key, so it's where the caps lock key would be like on a Windows device, and hold that and hit V, so that's this is the new paste, it's called multi-paste you're gonna see this little thing pop up and you can see the last five things that I have uh, copied. And so I'm gonna delete one of those and just so you can kind of see what I'm talking about here. Uh, this is new. So now I'm gonna highlight that. I'm going to and copy it just like we did before. And when I go to paste now with this multi-paste, so everything key and V, you can see this is new. The last thing that I just copied is now ready to be pasted. If I click it, that's what pastes. But if I don't want that, I can key down or use my mouse to click onto one of these other things that I just randomly uh, grabbed before we started the video. And that works too. Here's the kicker. Um, I copied a, a photo uh, before, but then I realized there's a better way uh, to show you guys some uh, something else cool on the Chromebook. Uh, so if you were to like right click and copy a photo, say somewhere off the web, um, it would show up just like this. So that photo would be there. Uh, it's not there right now. That looks, if you can kind of tell, that looks like the background on this Chromebook. Same thing would work here. Uh, so copying a photo allows you to click it and paste it in place. But also, if you take a screen grab, which I can't do right now because I'm recording my screen with the screen grab tool, uh, that's what that picture is right there. The minute you take that screen grab, let me see if my notification is still here. I don't think that it is. No, it's not. Uh, it's the minute you take that screen grab, it actually will copy that to your clipboard, and that's what you're seeing right there. Uh, right before we were setting up, I just did a quick screen grab of my desktop and that it put it in there as something you can paste. So what's really fun about that is if you need to quickly share uh, a basic screen grab of something, say you're in a chat and a text thread or something like that, you can do a screen grab and then immediately just go, you know, search uh, or everything key V and that photo will be right there for you to share. You just click it and it'll pop it in there. And so this gives you the tool to be able to copy and paste multiple things at once and then go and drop them in. So for instance, if I need to make a Twitter post uh, and say, I want to get the, you know, the, the text uh, portion and then I need to go copy a link from something to share, I can just go copy both of those things. And then when I go into Twitter, say, I'm gonna click on this, I don't remember. Oh yeah, so that's that title. So say that's my text and then do this again, uh, everything key and V and then click the link, I can drop both of those things in at one time instead of jumping back and forth between windows to get that same task done. And so it's super duper handy. Uh, it's something I don't just use every once in a while. I literally use this a hundred times a day. It's become the new habit uh, when I go to paste things. I will pull that little window up and actually choose exactly what it is I'm gonna paste. And so hopefully, if you didn't know how to copy and paste, you know, just using the keyboard, you learned that today. But also, hopefully you've learned that there are some extra ways that you can copy and paste stuff on your Chromebook that can make you just a little bit more productive. But that's it for this one. If you guys enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up, head down there, hit that subscribe button, and be sure to ring the notification icon as well if you'd like to be alerted when we make future videos just like this one. Until next time, we'll see you.